Governor Hochul today speaking as a Democrat when laying out her legislative priorities. Republicans have a different plan for New York. A news to ABC Stephanie Rivas reporting live now with the GOP reaction to today's address and their perspective on the future of the state. Stephanie. Lydia and John, we spoke with Senate Minority Leader Rob Ort right here in this hallway after his speech. He said the state of the state was light on substance and heavy on platitudes. This morning, he wanted to remind New Yorkers out there that there is an alternative plan laying out the Republican Take Back New York 2022 agenda. We are going to present that alternative today and each and every day we are here in Albany and beyond. Or driving home that Democrats support a bail reform is causing a rise in crime. We got to stop thinking about criminals as victims. I know we all want to think about my colleagues across the aisle. They believe that the robber is a victim. Hochul's agenda doesn't include a change to bail reform. She hopes to combat crime by upping gun tracing initiatives. And we'll trace guns used in crimes and stop the flow of guns into our state. You know, it still uh, sounds like a lot of uh, uh, coddling of criminals even though it's very vague and soft language she's, she's using. Uh, we'll, we'll see what comes out in her budget address and what those details are. Senator Sue Serino says many New Yorkers are fed up with the one-party control in New York State. It's clear that our neighbors are tired of government overreach and frustrated that they pay the highest taxes in the nation and see so little for their return. Overall, the state Republican agenda is laser focused right now on bolstering the economy and improving public safety. Reporting live at the state capitol, I'm Stephanie Rivas, News 10 ABC.